When you see them, you know that lots of things are possible that others may think are impossible. They're a beautiful family. It's obvious how much they love him and how he responds to them. 17 years ago, Marcus Clark was born with cerebral palsy, which affects his muscle control. Marcus has seizures. He is also susceptible to pneumonia. He cannot walk or even sit up in bed by himself. He has to take his nutrition through a feeding tube. He can't talk. But Marcus can love. Even though his communication is impaired, he understands, you know, his brain is still there and his eyes and his ears. Marcus's caregivers have challenges of their own. His mother, Sandy, has significant learning disabilities. His grandmother, Irene, is blind. Irene is a strong, loving, unassuming woman who has the intellect and the strength to keep her whole family together. Sandy is Irene's eyes. Doctors and nurses at Children's Healthcare of Atlanta have helped Marcus's mother and grandmother accomplish a miracle, making it possible to care for him at home. The nurse has many, many roles, one of them being a teacher, an educator. They had to put the formula in a bag, put it on a pump, and dial in the numbers to get the correct amount in there. So we had to make sure they knew how to do all of that. They were ready, they were eager, and it was wonderful. They don't leave here without knowing what needs to happen for Marcus, and they want to make sure he has the best care that he can get. They just know what every movement, every sound, everything means, and that just comes from just love. The nurses love him and care for him also and look at him as one of their children. He's one of ours. He's one of our boys. I stay with Marco until death do him harm. And you know, I just, as long as I'm able to do what I can do for him, that's what I want. I just want to be with him. That's what I see his family doing. That's what I see the nurses doing, and the doctors, and all of the staff that interact with him to make sure that this young man has the best life possible. And that's what I think is happening. We've seen some pretty tough times with Marcus, but he's, he's really done well. I guess it just goes to show you what commitment can make happen.